Hello everybody, Paul Jancarella from Profits and Success here to talk to you about pleasure and happiness and what the difference is. Over my shoulder, you can see somebody who is not supposed to be on the couch at any time and he can't hear. Well, he pretends he can't hear. He's got selective hearing. But why is he on the couch? Because mom's at work and I, I let him stay. <laughs> Anyhow, pleasure and happiness. Uh, last night, listening to Matthew Kelly, um, a very dynamic speaker. He's a passionate Catholic as well as an entrepreneur. And uh, there's my mother. She's making it happen, going outside drying some clothes, doing some weeding. A lot of action going on here, a lot of action. Anyhow, with Matthew Kelly, uh, he had a um, lecture on pleasure and happiness, and I picked up a great point. He said the difference between pleasure and happiness. That woman right there gives me pleasure. I, on the other hand, I give her pain. I'm a big pain in her side, but I try to be a good son in law. So, Matthew Kelly said, Pleasure cannot be sustained any longer than the activity producing it. Let me say that again. Pleasure cannot be sustained any longer than the activity producing it. And he gave an example, which was good because I was getting, I wasn't getting a good grasp on that. He said, we receive pleasure from eating. Great pleasure for, for some of us from eating. And when we stop eating, there's no longer pleasure. And that's why we continue to eat, most of us. Uh, and I thought that was a great example. You know, another excellent example is is alcohol and drugs and prescription drugs you know we take them to seek pleasure uh, but what they do when we stop is really cause withdrawals and pain and and it's not a not a good thing but what i want to share with you that is a great thing is reading books books are very pleasurable um, depending on what books you you choose but right here the iceberg effect if you choose this book and you're an affiliate marketer specifically one that's new to the game or one that's really having a difficult time to make things work, I suggest you read this book and you will gain pleasure. When you're done reading it, that pleasure will end. However, happiness will ensue if you implement the features outlined in this book unquestionably. So I suggest you read the book and do what it takes to implement the features in this book. It's a step-by-step -step basis. Uh, it's really good, really good. I, I, I don't wanna put words that may be false hope. So let's just leave it at, read the book, take it at face value, understand that this book, for me anyhow, uh, turned my online career around. It opened up my my eyes and take it at that. In the meantime, have a good day. Dugan's having a good day. Stay well, be well. We'll talk to you soon.